All right, so this time through, once again, let's try to get in touch with that um, attraction that these two characters have for one another. Hey. Uh, yes, it's it's Mrs. Warren. Uh, Mrs. Warren, do you like the guns better facing out, or are you liking better facing facing in? Uh, at this point, I I I, I, I don't know. I kind of like them out. Kind of like them out here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. I don't feel like talking to her. Well, I couldn't, and I think you might all remember that this little lady, if she wanted to, could press charges and you'd sent you to a penitentiary for violation of the Man Act. The what act? The Man Act. You took a woman over the state line against her will. I loved her. That wouldn't be a hint or anything now, would it? Why? Do you have an apartment like that, Grace? I'm a hard-working man. Oh, me. I'm a hard-working man. I owe me own me. Owe me my own ranch. <laughs> I own my own ranch. <laughs> oh yeah, I know Dobson, Vern Dobson, a prince of a fellow. You, have you read the play? Do you realize that Carl is not a cowboy? I think it looks pretty not. good like this. I mean, I just kind of pictured it, you know, it's the Old West, and like everybody kind of, everybody wears a cowboy hat and carries guns in the Old West, right? This is not the Old West, this is 1955. When was the Old West? All right, that's, that's good, that's good. Who, who do we have, who do we have next?